Hello and welcome to this webinar with the topic WLAN Commissioning WolfLink Interface Module. We would like to explain the WLAN Commissioning of our WolfLink Interface Module step by step. These interface modules are necessary in order to integrate WOLF units in the WOLF SmartSet system. The WOLF SmartSet system is a system in which WOLF heating, ventilation and air handling systems as well as CHPs can be integrated. The systems can be operated and monitored locally or via Internet worldwide. For the integration, we need an interface module, the WolfLink Home or the WolfLink Pro. The operation, the programming and monitoring is possible via online SmartSet portal or via SmartSet app for smartphones, tablets or computers. Let's take a look to the scope of supply. The scope of supply of the WolfLink Home comprises one interface module, one installation and operating instruction, one connection cable, which is only necessary if the WolfLink Home is installed next to the HCM2 board, one network cable, three cable strain reliefs and one additional label. The WolfLink Pro scope of supply comprises one interface module, one installation and operating instruction, three cable strain reliefs, one USB cable and one USB power supply for 230 volts, one eBus connection cable and one network cable. Let's take a more detailed look to the WolfLink Home. The WolfLink Home is designed for the Wolf Control System 2, WRS2, and will be installed inside the unit. The LEDs on the right hand bottom show the current operation status. On the left hand top is the plug in possibility of the connection cable to the heating unit. The gray cover should prevent damage to the board. The module has an access point. On the label, you can find the material number, serial number, browser address line, and one individual password. The WolfLink Pro is designed for the Wolf Control System WRS and Wolf Control System WRS2. Furthermore, the Link Pro offers a Modbus interface in addition. Due to this reason, Wolf Air Handling ventilation and CHPs can be integrated into the WOLF Smart Set system. An access point is available here too. The label contains the material number, serial number, browser address line and an individual password. The LEDs show the current operation status here too. The WolfLink Pro is designed for an external assembly. On this slide, you can see the meaning of the LEDs. Both WolfLink interface modules have three LEDs. The current operation status can be detected via installation instruction. The green LED is for the portal, the yellow one is for the eBus and Modbus, and the red one for WLAN. Depending on the flashing code, different meanings are possible. Let's take a look to the function of the button which is on the WolfLink interface module for WolfLink Home in the lower area for WolfLink Pro. After removing the front cover, the button is on the right hand side in the lower area of the board. The access point can be activated after short pressing of the button below one second manually. The access point will be active automatically in case of first operation or after module reset. The access point is not necessary for standard commissioning. That's the reason why we won't take a look at it during this webinar. The WPS function of WolfLink can be activated via pressing the button between 3 to 5 seconds. A reset can be done when the button will be pressed for more than 10 seconds. Please take care that in case of reset, 
the power supply has to be interrupted shortly after pressing the button for 10 seconds. As already mentioned, it, the Wolflink Home is designed for the Wolf control system WRS2. Gas condensing boiler CGB2, split heat pump BWL1S, modulating oil condensing boiler TOB and gas condensing boiler MGK2 are equipped with the Wolf control system WRS2. In this unit, you can integrate the Wolflink Home. The Wolflink Pro can be used for the Wolf Control System WRS and for the Wolf Control System 2 WRS2. So it is possible to integrate older generations in the Wolf SmartSet system. For example, the two-step oil condensing boiler COB, gas condensing boiler MGK, monoblock heat pump BWL. If an I.O. module is installed in the TOB, a Wolflink Pro must be selected because the I.O. module needs the space for the Wolflink Home. Air handling and ventilation units as well as combined heat and power units can be only integrated in the SmartSet system via a mode bus interface. Due to this reasons, a Wolflink Pro is absolutely necessary. Let us install a Wolflink Home in a CGS2. With the operation switch, we can turn off the unit. We turn the control system casing to the side and open the flap for the interface module. The Wolflink Home will be clipped into the flap. Subsequently, we plug the connection cable between the heating unit and module. So the module can be supplied with power and an eBus connection can be generated. The connection cable is integrated in the control system casing for all variations of CGP2 and for the split heat pump serially. We press the operation switch anew. The module will be supplied with power. The yellow LED starts to flash. We activate the WPS function at the router constantly. The WPS function has to be activated at the module within 30 seconds. In addition, please press the button at the module for 3 to 5 seconds. The red LED starts to flash quickly. The flap can be closed now and the control system casing can be swung back. The module is installed. Before we will start the commissioning, we will take a look at the installation of the Wolflink Pro. First of all, we will remove the torque screw at the casing. We open the front cover and install the Wolflink Pro at the wall. We establish the eBus connection between module and heating unit. The module will be supplied via a USB cable and the corresponding AC adapter with power. As soon as the module will be supplied with power, we will activate the WPS function on the router. Afterwards, the WPS function has to be activated at the module within 30 seconds. Therefore, press the button at the module between 3 and 5 seconds. The red LED starts to flash quickly. Now we can close the casing again. The module is installed. To complete the standard commissioning, the latest Wolf SmartSet app for the smartphone is required. The Wolf SmartSet app is available for download in the Google Play Store and App Store for free. We download the latest SmartSet app on the smartphone and open it. At the bottom left hand corner, the system can be controlled and monitored local via the function Use without Internet. Please take care that the smartphone is in the same WLAN network. To enable worldwide access to the system, we start the commissioning assistant and the app. We open the menu at the top left hand side and select the commissioning assistant. The 
Wolf Link appears. We press on selecting. Now we will be asked for the individual password. This can be seen on the Wolf Link or on the additional label which is in the scope of supply. After entering the password, we press the button for the internet connection. The Wolf Link restarts. In the next step, we get to the registration. If you already have a SmartSet account, please press here. In case you don't have a SmartSet account, please fill in the registration form, address, first name, name, email address and your personally chosen SmartSet account password. Please accept the terms of use, privacy notice and declaration of consent. Press register in the next step. In order to finish the registration, you have to fill in the confirmation code, the necessary code you will receive via email. Optionally, you can click the link in the email. After filling in the confirmation code, please press complete registration. The setting has been stored in your SmartSet account successfully. You can start the visualization now. After the commissioning assistance, the whole functionality of the SmartSet app is available worldwide. If several systems are assigned to your account, you can select the desired system in the system selection. Of course, you can also log in with your SmartSet access data in the online SmartSet portal and operate, program and monitor the system from the PC worldwide. Now we have reached the end of the webinar. A lot of fun with the Wolf SmartSet system. Thank you and goodbye.